Welcome to Frostborn Showcase. I will be talking about Warmage. It is the most interesting picture in any other class's pictures. This class is very unique to any class. Let's take a look at it. Warmage 4 first came out from Season 18, and it was at the end of the season reward for free. You can only get it in the frail world. Warmage 4 is a light armor specialization, and it is a PvP and control type. It has the same amount of damage and health, and those amounts are quite high for a Warmage. The damage buff will go to any weapon. Let's take a look at those skills. Fire Sword. First off, this is the main passive skill of the Warmage. Whatever weapon you have in your hand, will magically turn into a Fire Sword. The attack speed will stay at 1, and attack damage will depend on your equipped weapon. The attack speed can be buffed if you are using Light Elven Armor or Shaman Staff. This Fire Sword will increase your Light Armor by 12%. And finally, Fire Swords will set the enemy on fire by 20% more sword damage for 4 seconds. Whenever you apply to burn on the enemy, the enemy will deal less than 20% damage to the Womage only. This helps the Womage to be tanky. Sword Throw An attack skill that allows you to throw a sword and return to you. It behaves like a boomerang. If you throw at the obstacle or wall, it will return automatically. You can also press that skill again, to shorten the range. In flight, it will deal 80% of your sword damage, so it means you deal 80% damage twice. And it will burn the damage for additional damage. After you throw the fire sword, you can only use a fist and telekinesis skill until your sword is back in your hand, and it increases your speed by 30%. You can use this speed to catch your opponent or run away. This skill is very useful to deal fast damage, and destroy a group of enemies. Telekinesis A control skill that you can move the enemy. You can move the enemy in any direction you want. It can knock back, pull, and even push them at the obstacles. If you use it on the enemy, it will apply slowness movement by 20% for 2 seconds. Pushing them at the obstacles will stun them for one and a half seconds, and deal the same damage from your equipped weapon. Very useful if the enemy is moving too fast, or add a stun combo easier, and you can use this to push them away from you, if you are in trouble. Let's take a look at PvP.
damage is very something, and it is great for both PvP and PvE. It is a new light class tank. If you equip the best equipment, it is difficult to take down. Since you can use any weapons you want. You can use a shield, elven support staff, a flask, and any weapons. It is very similar to the druid class, but the damage can be buffed dramatically. Throwing sword skill can deal great damage, however, using a low damage like a flask weapon, is not effective. So the high damage weapon is recommended for that skill. Telekinesis is a great control skill, great for catching range attackers, and easier to add stun combo. I think it is great for raids, because there are so many walls you can use telekinesis. No matter where they go, they can get stunned by slamming on the walls. This is very troublesome for raids. What do you think of the war mage? That's all for now. Warmage is awesome and a mystery. This class reminds me of Darth Maul from the Star Wars movie. Go ahead and press that like and subscribe button below. I nearly have 1000 subscribers. Thanks for watching, and grow strong, my friend.